Hello everyone, welcome. Hello Hayden, hello Paka, welcome. Who else is here? Say hello. How's everyone doing? Good morning. Hello, Philia. How's everyone's Monday going? Did you have a Christmas party? How was it? I had a Christmas party with my housemates yesterday. It was really fun. What about you guys? Are you guys doing anything special? What did you do for the party? Did you prepare food? Did you prepare gifts? Was it fun? Today is the 21st. What? How was your Zoom Christmas party? I wonder. All right, let's get on with it. Today is the 21st. Today is the 21st. Oh, you guys have Christmas party today. So do Mr. Men. It was really fun, Parker. You love it? Amazing. Good morning, Eugene. Lovely to see you here. Today we have Miss Samantha Christmas party, just like what you guys have had today. Mr. Men, the Christmas party. The postman delivered a letter to Timble Cottage. Do you know who lives there? Why? It's little Miss Shy. Although you'd hardly know because she is so shy you barely ever see her. The letter was an invitation from Mr. Happy to his Christmas party. Hello, Philia. Hayden, you've got games on Zoom Christmas party. That's good. Part of little Miss Shy really wanted to go to the party. But part of her was really, really, really too shy. She knew that she would walk into the party and blush and knowing that she was going pink would only make her turn even pinker. Just the thought of it made her blush. Mr. Happy had a great deal to do to get ready for the party, but he had lots of help. Mr. Strong had been, hello Cyrus. Oh, do you not have Christmas party? I'm sorry about that, but you can still have a lot of fun at home. Mr. Strong had been instructed to go out and find a good-sized tree. And he did! A lovely, huge tree. Mr. Muddle glued the Christmas lights and plucked the paper chain. Mr. Muddle, you're not supposed to glue the lights and you're not supposed to pluck the paper chains. You pluck into the lights. Mr. Greedy made a cake, but it was not so much a yule log as a yule tree trunk because the tree was the cake was so so big. And little Miss Naughty brought the mistletoe and brought the mistletoe and chased Mr. Happy all around the hall trying to kiss him. Because you kiss under the mistletoe. 
Despite all this help, everything was cooked and decorated and laid and hung the day before the party. Amazing. Mr. Happy went to bed feeling, well, very happy. But little Miss Sha did not go to bed. She could not sleep. What should she do about the party? She would be sad if she didn't go, but she would blush if she did. Would she go? Could she go? What a dilemma! When she looked out of the window the next morning, she could not believe her eyes. It has snowed, it snowed and snowed and snowed, it snowed so much. More than a lot, it snowed buckets. Mildred Miss Shy breathed a sigh of relief. <sighs> the party would have to be cancelled. Nobody would be able to get to the hall with this amount of snow. When Mr. Happy saw the snow, he did not feel the same. He felt, well, he was very, very unhappy. Poor Mr. Happy, it was a disaster. He was going to have to ring everyone and tell them the party was off and cancelled. He rang Mr. Christmas first, but Mr. Christmas had an idea. One phone call later, he rang Mr. Happy back. It's all sorted out. I'm going to borrow Father Christmas's sleigh and give everybody a lift to the party. Oh, Mr. Christmas is helpful. Which is just what he did. He flew here and there, collecting everyone in the flying sleigh for the party. Everyone except Mr. Tor, whose long legs made short walks of these snowdrifts. So Mr. Tor's wonderful long legs makes it easy for him to walk around in this snow. The last person he collected was Little Miss Shy. Then Little Miss Shy sighed, I can't go in. When they reached the hall, please take me home. I can't go in and have the party. Please take me home. I'm too nervous. I'm too shy. And so Mr. Christmas exclaimed, but why? You have fun and everyone wants to see you. But when I go in, I'll blush with embarrassment, explained Little Miss Shy. I think you will find, said Mr. Christmas, that everyone has got rosy cheeks on on as cold a night as this it is so cold everyone's cheeks will be rosy red not just yours but their cheeks are red because they're cold your cheeks are red and rosy because you're shy but nobody will know that and do you know what mr christmas was right everyone else looked just as pink cheeked as with Miss shy thank you mr christmas she said Mr. Silly and his fantastic elastic band. Elastic band, look at that. They're having they're having a band with a shower head. Oh, that's very, very funny. And a broomstick. Came on stage and the party got started. They're playing silly music. Mr. Silly. And what a wonderful party it was. They ate and then they drank and they chattered and they gossiped and they danced and then they singing all evening long. And Little Miss Shy joined in and had a fantastic time. Nobody even actually noticed her rosy pink shy cheeks. You're still looking very pink in the face, said Mr. Happy. Are you still feeling shy? And then little Miss Shy replied, Shy? No. I'm just very hot from all this dancing. Happy Christmas, Mr. Happy. Oh, that is so sweet. At the end of the party, she's not feeling shy anymore. She was just feeling hot from the dancing. Hello, Marcus. Isn't that a wonderful story? How little Miss Shy got over her shyness and nerves to get to a party. Maybe sometimes if you feel shy, you should just go ahead, like Little Miss Shy as well. Just go ahead and it will work out fine, right? How do you like this story? Today we finished the story, Mr. Men, the Christmas Party. 
if you came in late in the session don't worry the video will be saved on facebook so later on you can watch it again or you can just catch up on it or any other stories from before today we read story number 21 because it is day 21 of december and we are just 22nd 23rd we're just three days away from christmas and three books to read i hope you have enjoyed the story today tomorrow we will have book number 22 another day closer to christmas i had this wonderful um christmas house party with my housemates yesterday and it was so much fun i hope you also had fun monday and party as well if you are having any party um things in hong kong um getting a bit rough yeah so are things here so i think i'm not i think i should stay home more and you know just stay extra extra careful i don't want to catch anything because i still need to go back to school later on in january and i think they've just announced in the news that they're banning all the flights from uk to hong kong so um well i'm not planning to go back to hong kong until um easter so let's hope like it's still a few months away so let's hope that things will improve before that these couple of months oh yeah you have jupiter and saturn conjunction today marcus i hope you have lots of fun i hope you will enjoy that and i will see you guys tomorrow same time half past five hong kong time yeah enjoy the rest of your monday and see you tomorrow bye